Hey everybody, let's talk about the topic graphing a parabola of the form y equals x squared plus bx plus c. So we were told to graph this parabola, but first we need to find the vertex and then find four additional points. So how do we find the vertex of this graph? Well, we could do it a few different ways. We could complete the square or we could directly find vertex. Because we're not ne told we need to put this in vertex form. Right? If you want to know how to put it in vertex form, see my other videos. But let's just go ahead and find the vertex. Now remember, the equation for the vertex, hk, is negative b over 2a and then the y value at that x value. So the x value is negative b over 2a and the y value is the function output at that x value or at that input. Now remember, parabolas ax squared plus bx plus c. In this case, a is 1. So hk is going to be, let's, let's first actually identify a. a is 1, so we have a 1 there. b is negative 4 and c is negative 6. Because in my equations I have positives right there. So what's negative b over 2a? That's going to be a positive 4 because a negative, negative 4 is positive 4 over 2 times 1. And then we're going to take f of whatever we get there. 4 divided by 2 times 1 is a positive 2. And then we're going to find f of 2. So how do we find f of 2? Well, y is our function outputs. So what's our function outputs at 2? Let's plug in 2 for x. 2 squared minus 4 times 2, rewrite that, minus 6, which ends up being 4 minus 8 minus 6. So what are we going to end up getting for y, and how did we find it? We're going to get negative 10 for y, which means our vertex hk is going to be at 2, negative 10. So we go to 2 and then we go to negative 10. Now how do we find plot two points on the left and right? Well we can do that with a table and we just take x values and plug it in. When we got when we plugged in 2, we got negative 10. So let's plug in a point to the right, which let's plug in 3. When we plug in 3, we'll get negative 9. So we have a point at 3, negative 9. When we plug in 4, we'll get negative 6. So we'll have a point at 4, negative 6. And remember the axis of symmetry helps you ha do only have to do half the work. So here's our vertex and if we go over one and up one, it's not like the slope, right? That's just happens to be how far away this point is from the axis of symmetry. And this point is at negative six and two away from the axis of symmetry. So let's go two away from the axis of symmetry on this side and plot another point. And if we wanted to, 
we could plug in, or needed to, we could plug in 1 and find that's at negative 9 and 0 and find that's at negative 6. Okay. So there's graphing a parabola of the form y equals x squared plus bx plus c.